so I took this thing down a lot farther than I'd originally planned. It was just so filthy. It, it needed it really bad. Ordered some parts. Uh, got this cleaned up. Got these shocks all cleaned up looking nice. You know, the shock uh, covers there. Got the gas tank passed. It had a little split there with some JB Weld. And, um, you know, just got everything cleaned up. There's a headset. Took that apart. There's a front fender. Clean that all up. It's really a lot of cleaning. Um, you know, I didn't order the new bearing kit for this. I'm just going to put the old ones back in there. And I got a new coil. We're going to get rid of this uh, Volkswagen coil here, whatever the hell that is. Here's the new cable set. KDI came through again. Oh, yeah, and a car, car boot. The other one shrunk. So here's all the new cables, car boot. There's a new coil. So, yeah, today is just reassembly. I actually went ahead and painted some of this stuff. I wasn't gonna, but it was just rusting too bad. So I sanded it down and uh, just, you know, put a couple layers of paint on it. And uh, same thing with the muffler. So yeah, we're gonna get this thing reassembled for the most part today. Um, you know, I, I, uh, I might put the tires on. I'm waiting on one tire, the front tire. I got the new rear one over there, but I ordered the wrong new one. So I had to send it back. But that's all we're waiting on. Um, we'll get this thing together and ride it, man. Here's the oil injector unit. And it took a little adjustment to get it synced with the car, but we joined together like right there. The cable comes in, splits, goes to the carb. So now, once that thing's activated, I mean that throttle slide lifts up at the same time. Let's see, but <laughs> it's on its way, man.
here it is. So uh, real quick, yeah, we got uh, new tires and tubes on there, new chain, new sprockets. Um, fix this clutch actuator cover. You remember that was cracked. Hopefully that'll last. New cables, uh, courtesy KDI. Uh, let's see, new air intake boot, courtesy KDI. We got uh, new, that was cracked, new intake flange. Rebuilt that carburetor. I got the original carburetor that came with the bike in a box as well. What else did we do? Um, oh yeah, new seat foam and cover, courtesy KDI. And uh, we got a new battery in there. Cleaned everything up, had to redo this air filter. That was kind of funky. And uh, oh yeah, we um, had to braze up this tank. It was split up here, but it is now not leaking. So that's why it looks a little funky there. Uh, replaced all the bulbs in the tack, speedo, uh, headlight, tail light. All the lights work, brake light works. And uh, runs great, man. We've been, I've been driving it all over this summer. Just having a great time on it. Um, here's the exhaust. We had to get a new stinger for it. Um, what else? Oh, yeah, new coil. We need a new coil. The coil was all shot, so. Um, what else? Oh, yeah, change the fork oil, engine oil, new spark plug. Uh, didn't rebuild the engine. That's an original engine there. Still runs. I'm the third owner. The second owner said he never had it rebuilt, so. Um, and he knew the first owner who actually raced this thing back in the day, believe it or not. So, yeah, it turned out great, man. Great old bike. I love it. Great thing to have. An original 1968 DT1, man. How cool is that? So there it is, people.